I love everyone and welcome back to America Truck Simulator. So I was going to do my uh, mod review on the uh, on the K100 and on the Mac, but they're not working for this version of the game. I am in the beta, the 1.5.1 beta of America Truck Simulator. So they're not working. So we're going to use the um, SCS W9 today. Okay, here we go. Let's go on route. We got some scrap cars, what we're hauling. In a walking, a walk, walking floor trailer here. So we kind of had some news, guys, that we were very close to a new truck releasing for ATS, which is awesome, because we need it. And it'll be the Mac Pinnacle. Get ready to turn right. So I removed all the mods that I was using. Right. Um, well, not all the mods, but I, I removed all the truck mods I was using until everything gets updated. But like I said, we are on the version of 1.5.1 beta for this game. And it's not always wise to use mods, uh, especially trucks, just for the last version of the game, because you do have issues like that. Checking our paperwork. Good rock and roll. What is going on with this thing? I might have to look at that and see why it's doing that because it shouldn't be. had that issue fixed. Alright, we're ready to roll. Truck run today. The truck's running Cummins N14 with 18 speed, even full of transmission. Now they have SCS has reworked this truck, guys. So this truck has been reworked. The Peterbilt has not been reworked, but they did rework this truck. And also they come out with a DLC for this truck that way it has more accessories for it, which I do have some of that on the truck. Not not as what, what, what everything you can do to it. I didn't want to do everything to it. I want to kind of keep it as much comfortable as a, like a company truck as I could, but add um, a little bit of luxury to it, I guess you could say. We gotta get over. Keep right, and then turn right. Right. I love all the sounds that we get now.
the good thing about it, I don't have to get a thumbnail because I've done this video earlier and I had issues with something and I didn't want to even use that video, so I already took a thumbnail. I'll just use that thumbnail. They're getting a lot better on building these trucks. When, these, when this game come Exit out, right. uh, you can kind of look at the um, the, the 579 Peterbilt. It was one of the first trucks to come out for this game. And you can look at the uh, the older T680. Even the 389 Peterbilt, that was some of the first trucks to come out. But look at the new ones like this one here where this has been updated. You can tell how much better it is. Uh, what they're doing, you know, how much more quality that they're putting in these trucks, and how much better they look, and all the detail they're doing to them now, and everything like that. So, I was going to do a regular run on, a, on ETS 2, but i got to finish that live stream. And I don't want to break off that where I will let all to do a regular run, so we'll just wait on that. not happening so we're going through it yeah I love all the sounds and stuff what are we getting oh it won't let us go through it okay and there's something new that they've done Normally we just go through it, but it's not gonna let it do that. Okay. Well. Never mind. I'll find us a new one. So I had to go around it. But no, let's go through there, so. The lag is uh, it's lagging so bad. I'm still trying to figure that. I think it's the beta. So we're having to go around this. Um, 
road the lady with the construction that uh, accident that uh keep right ahead. and then exit right. Exit right. Get ready to turn left. Turn left. Why are they doing that? Turn left. We have a traction control and ATS and ABS back on. Is it right? Um.
go straight on. That's right. Oh, this is really changed. Straight on. That's right. Sugar. I'd look at that and say why I'm doing that. All right, drop our load. there where they want See around there, it's off by it. Watch the ladder.
not good. Uh, that's not the best, but it has, we'll make it work. All right, so we drove exit 160 miles, took us five hours, 18 minutes. Get here, we can send 22, 22 gallons of fuel. Alright guys, we're gonna go ahead and wrap up this video doing a normal run on the on ATS using the W900. Thank you for watching, thank you for watching. I have been subscribed to channel, please like channel growth, and we'll see you in the next video stream.